In this video, I'll be showing you how to set up WooCommerce conversion tracking in Google Analytics 4, Universal Analytics, and WordPress. By setting up conversion tracking on your WooCommerce site, you can track add to cart clicks, remove from cart clicks, overall conversion rate, abandoned checkouts, total purchases, items purchased, top traffic sources resulting in purchases, average order value, and a lot more. Once you've enabled WooCommerce conversion tracking, you'll find all the information that you need to optimize your store. The best way to enable conversion tracking on your WooCommerce store for both GA4 and Universal Analytics is to use the Monster Insights plugin. You won't have to edit any code or hire a developer, plus you can easily track other conversions like form submissions, video clicks, affiliate link clicks, and more. First, you'll need to use Monster Insights Pro, so head over to the Monster Insights pricing page and select Monster Insights Pro. Now, once you're all signed up, in your account area, you'll need to go to the Download tab and download the zip file of the plugin. Next, go to your WordPress site and on the admin sidebar, click Plugins, then click Add New, and then click the Upload Plugin button at the top of the page. Now, you can either click Choose File or just drag and drop the zip file here and click Install Now. Now, once that's done, just activate the Monster Insights plugin. Okay, now you'll need to connect Google Analytics 4 or Universal Analytics or both to your site. Now, this will install the Google Analytics code on your site automatically. If you'd like more details, just check out the link in the description to our guide on how to add Google Analytics to WordPress. Next, you'll need to install the Monster Insights e-commerce add-on. Now, to do that, go to Insights and then click Add-ons. Now, scroll down to e-commerce and click the Install button. Now, just enable enhanced e-commerce tracking. If you're only using GA4, you can skip this step. Once you've activated the add-on, you have to enable enhanced e-commerce tracking in Analytics. So to do that, log into Analytics and select the website you'd like to enable enhanced e-commerce tracking for. Next, click Admin in the left taskbar. Then click e-commerce settings under the column on the right. Next, switch on the settings for Enable e-commerce and Enable Enhanced e-commerce reporting. Now, Monster Insights will begin tracking conversions on your WooCommerce site and you won't have to touch a line of code. After the Google Analytics integration, you can view your e-commerce reports in your WordPress dashboard by going to Insights, then to Reports, and then to e-commerce. Now, I'll go over the metrics that you'll see after you've connected it with Google Analytics 4, which we highly recommend. First, you'll see an overview and top products reports at the top. As you scroll down the page, you'll see your store's top conversion sources. These are traffic sources that send customers who've completed purchases to your site. And finally, you'll see the total added and removed from cart events, the percentage of new customers, and the percentage of abandoned checkouts. If you want even more details, just click the View Report button at the bottom of the Products and Conversion Sources report, and you'll be taken to your Google Analytics for property where you can explore your reports. To view your e-commerce reports in Google Analytics 4, you'll need to navigate to Monetization and then to Overview. Now, once you're there, you can see your revenue trend by day, purchases by day, purchases by item name, purchases by item list, and more. To see more details about items purchased, you can navigate to Monetization and then to e-commerce purchases. To view your sales and revenue data organized by channel, go to Acquisition, then Traffic Acquisition. Now scroll to the right in the table to find conversions and total revenue. Click the All Events drop-down arrow under Conversions and select Purchase. Now the table shows total purchases and revenue by traffic channel. Now we'll look at how to see your WooCommerce data in Universal Analytics. Keep in mind that Universal Analytics will sunset July the 1st, 2023, so you should begin using Google Analytics 4 as soon as possible. To see your e-commerce conversion data, first navigate to Conversions, and then to E-commerce, then Overview. And there you have it. In just a few steps, you've successfully enabled WooCommerce conversion tracking by turning on Enhanced E-commerce Tracking in Google Analytics with Monster Insights. With Monster Insights, you get the website stats that matter. See why we're used by more than 3 million websites. If you're not already using Monster Insights, there's a discount link in the description. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials, explainers, and helpful content like this. We'll see you next time.